Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a shopping haul as I went to the designer outlet village today and got a few things. It was so nice to just get out the house and go somewhere and do something and it was just really nice being able to go in the shops and looking at the things and so yeah it's just been so long since we've been able to do this. The shops reopened on Monday, it's Saturday today, so not even a week yet. It's just been crazy, the shops have been crazy, but today it wasn't too bad in the outlet village. It was busy, but not overly busy. It was really nice to get out and have a walk around, and it was also a nice sunny day as well, so that was a plus. And then we also went to B&M as well, so we had a look in there as well. So I'm going to show you what we grabbed as I went with my mum and Josh. So the first shop I went in was Neon Sheep, which I absolutely love this shop. I don't know if you're all familiar with this shop or not, but this is Neon Sheep. It, this is a cute little logo as well. And I love this shop so much. It's got some really nice things in there. Some nice stationery bits and they've got some really nice decor stuff as well which I, I love um so i saw this and i really wanted it and i'm not sure i'm not sure where i'm gonna put it yet so i've got this it's a rose gold round metal shelf and i absolutely love it it was seven pounds down from ten pounds so it's got a shelf here, here and here. I just really loved it and I want to put like some really nice things on it. I really liked it and I love rose gold as you can tell. So I've got this. Um, also, they have some of these in B&M without the three shelves. It's just the one here. I prefer the three shelves so you can stick more things on. And they had lots more designs as well. And then I went into Wittards. I haven't been in there for so long. And there's a drink in there that I really like that I haven't had for a few years now. So I thought I'd go in there and grab it. So they have changed the packaging on it actually. But I love this drink. And I haven't had so long. So I got the... It's a cream brulee flavour white hot chocolate and it's so nice and I can't wait to have some, probably have some tonight maybe, I don't know. Indulge in the sumptuous flavour of vanilla and caramel and it's really nice and they had a deal on for two for £12 I think it was. So Josh picked out another flavour and he picked out the raspberry ripple white hot chocolate and it says whoever heard of pink hot chocolate when it came to raspberry ripple we couldn't resist and it just sounds really nice as well so i'm gonna give this one a try and i already know i like this one but some nice drinks to try and then we went into cabri's world shop and josh got a pack of 10 double deckers Ooh which were a pound a pen which is a bargain and then i got a pack of six and these are cadbury's snack shortcake which sound really nice and there's two oh wait no there's four in a pack as well so there's quite a few in here then uh, i thought i'd try these they just look really nice so i thought i'd buy these these were about 250 i think grabbed a drink as well rubicorn black cherry raspberry i love this drink and josh got um a mango snapple my mum got a pack of five crunchy bars and she also got a pack of dairy milk fingers i love these and she got a bar of milka looks like milk chocolate and white chocolate together which is interesting i think this is a new bar also while we were in cadbury's they had a minute silence while we were in the shop for the queen's husband so obviously it was his funeral today so we had a minute silence in the shop and i think 
the whole outlet just stood still in silence um so yeah i didn't know that was actually going to happen we was currently at the till when that was happening and so they had to stop serving and we all stood there silent for one minute for the queen's husband and then we went into the work and i'll show you what we've got in there so we just really went in there just to have a look at the stuff in there and ended up buying stuff i didn't buy anything but josh did so he brought these two 3d puzzles so they're two for five pounds or four pounds each so it made sense to get something else for a pound so we got this skull puzzle 3d puzzle to try and he brought this crystal car puzzle as well so he's gonna try those out and i'm probably gonna try them out with him as well something to do when you're bored and it's quite a good um deal as well two for five pounds and then my mum brought a few things as well so we're gonna see the kids tomorrow so she bought a few things for the kids to do um on the two to five two for five pound deal so we've got four things in the deal so the first one is neon rock painting which looks really cute and fun i love i love rock painting i remember when everyone was doing it here and hiding them in the parks some people still do it actually it comes with the rocks and a few paints and two paint brushes and a little book and then we got world of gems excavation four in one so it's dig to discover four amazing gems and these are the things you find inside but you got to dig them out with a chisel a wooden mallet and a brush it comes with four dig blocks and four gifts and an instruction book. It comes with these tools. I don't know if you can see them properly. So you've got to dig the gems out of the rocks, which looks quite fun to me. And then we saw this thousand plus crystals. Basically, it's a diamond art for kids. Well, anyone really who enjoys it. So it's a wolf and it comes with all the gems and the little tray and the little diamond art pen. This was also in the deal as well. So that's a pretty good bargain. We thought they'd like to try that. We've I've got loads of diamond art myself. I've got the big ones. Loads of diamond art. Which we like sitting in the evening sometimes around the table doing all our diamond art. And the fourth item was a 3D Astro Bingo. So they can have a game of bingo as well. Which is also fun. So she got an app puzzle which is one of these sliding ones. Sliding ones. But that looks interesting. Tidy your apps and get them into order. Starting with the main home tile at the bottom and sliding only one tile at a time challenge is to rearrange your apps till the home is on in the top left corner we then went to costa and grabbed a takeaway i grabbed a belgium chocolate frostino with cream josh got the mint chocolate frostino and my mum got a white hot chocolate i also had a cornflake cake and my mum had i think a cookie or something josh had a wrap and obviously it's takeaway only at the moment you can't sit in yet so we decided we'd walk to b&m while we had our costa and well, that's really heavy so we bought some things from b&m as well this is my bag and my mum's got a bag down there that i'll show you after i don't know why but we grabbed a load of food for some reason today so josh got this massive bottle of iron brew and yeah josh loves his drinks so we've got an iron brew and 
I got some M&M's Crunchy. I love these. I had an M&M's Crunchy Easter egg. Um, and now I'm into M&M's Crispy. And this is a LucasAid Sport Fruit Punch, which I've not tried before. Quite a big bottle. And Josh found out that I can have this drink because it's got no spa team in. So I'm happy because I've not been able to have one of these before. And so I'm going to try it. And I know it's just a drink, but to me it's actually quite big because I can't have a spa team in my drink. And most drinks have a spa team in. It's hard to find a drink without it. And this is an apple and raspberry, so I can't wait to try that. And now I'm happy I can get a LucasAid still drink. Some Kentucky Fried Chicken Max Crisps. I love these. I tried them a few weeks ago. And now I love them. So I've got some of those in for me and Josh. Then I've got this LucasAid. I don't see this drink anywhere else other than B&M. And it's a citrus chill and it's really nice and it's a clear one i don't know if you can see it's actually clear i love the packaging as well again it's not got a spa team in which i love because i can have it i can have the caribbean crushed one as well the rest of the lucas aids now all have spa team in which i'm not happy about and then i saw these everywhere in bm i've got these container organizers so i've got this these small ones two trays for 150 which is a bargain so i got these i wanted them in the pink but they didn't have any left so the gray and um, again i wanted these in pink as well but they didn't have any left and these ones were three pounds and you get two in a pack and they had lots of different sizes as well so i'm hoping to use them in my drawers and tidy my drawers a bit saw this and it's iridescent and i love it i just love the color and it's 3.99 and it's a bath mat so i thought i'd get a new bath mat for my bath um, because i do need a, ba a new bath mat to be honest because i don't like the one that's in there and i thought this one was just really pretty so i got this why not I actually had some really nice decor in B&M that I just loved, but I can't buy everything. Josh did buy something else. He brought something and he opened it straight away when he got in, so he's already cut it open. It was a 24-piece cordless screwdriver set um, with a drill, and it was $9.99 from B&M. And as you can see, he's already open. It can wait five minutes. So it's got a battery charger with it, magnetic connector, 17 screwdriver bits, and six twist drills. So he wanted to get a drill. I thought it'd be handy to have if we haven't got one. I'll just show you as he's opened it. This is what the drill looks like. Let me just press it on and it's quite a cute little one actually isn't it and it comes with all of these bits i'll just show you like this otherwise i'd probably just drop them everywhere so it's got all the drill pieces inside that you need all different sizes as well my mum has got let's have a look my mum got some of these storage trays as well just in this size and um, she also got this cute collapsible lunch box including a spork so it's got a spoon one end a fork the other that's quite cool and it collapses to less than half its original size it's only three pounds which is really good and these are really handy as well so it's a nice colour actually as well. So it folds down into that size and it opens up. And these are quite good for a picnic. This is the spork. There's the spoon and the fork. It's all in one. That's why it's called a spork. And she's got a pack of Smarties. A pack of four. She loves her Smarties. She's got a 
got some cheese savouries, which we love. I love these. They're really nice. And she's got some Zaflora disinfectant linen fresh. Free in one action. So, I don't know why I'm doing that. And she's got some original chalk nibbles, which I tried these last time we went to B&M. Josh got some, and they look really nice. So it's real milk chocolate, caramel, and dusted with icing sugar. They're really, really nice. They're really yummy, so you should try these. And I've also got some KFC crisps. Ooh, got some more chocolate nibbles, but birthday cake flavour. I didn't really get these flavours. Vanilla nibbles with real milk chocolate and candy sprinkles. I've got to try these ones. She also got this, which was a pack of three flexi storage baskets. These are more flexible, as you can see. They're more flexible. Or oh, these were only two pounds for a pack of three as well. And it's in a nice pink. This is what I wanted. This colour in these baskets, but there's just none left obviously popular and i feel like i'm getting hidden behind all the stuff so sorry about that i also forgot to show you this what i got in bnm it's just some blue dragon spicy thai noodles that i thought i'd try um so yeah that's the last thing so that's everything that we got today on our shopping trip and i hope you liked this video if you did please give it a thumbs up comment below and subscribe for more videos like this one and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys